first step is to place the UPS into bypass by placing the load on maintenance bypass. Start by placing the UPS into static bypass by pressing the pound or hashtag button on the display. The display will show bypass operation colon no. Change this by pressing the C button on the display. The display will now read Bypass Operation Yes. Press the Pound button to save the change. The UPS is now in Static Bypass. You will notice on your Maintenance Bypass cabinet that the H3 light above the Q3 breaker is now illuminated. This indicates that it is safe to operate the Q3 breaker with no risk of dropping your load. Turn the Q3 breaker to the on position. Once the Q3 breaker is in the on position, the H2 LED above the Q2 breaker will illuminate indicating it is now safe to operate with no risk to your load. Turn the Q2 breaker off. Now that your load is safely in maintenance bypass, it is safe to power down the UPS. Start by opening the front door of the UPS. Inside, you will notice a green button and a red button. Press the red button. The audible acoustic alarm will sound for 30 seconds. You can silence this alarm by pressing the alarm silence button on the display. The next step is to turn off your battery breakers, or in some cases, open or disconnect your battery fuses in the main UPS or external battery cabinet. To finish the process, turn off the utility feed to the UPS by turning off or opening the Q1 breaker on your maintenance bypass panel. 